Well, hello guys and girls out there, wherever you are. Welcome to another totally random video. And in today's video, I want to show you something really nice and interesting that I just purchased for my girlfriend. It's something that some of you probably don't even know that it exists. Um, as you know, not only vinyl records are making a huge comeback, but cassettes as well. And my girlfriend, she likes cassettes and she's a huge fan of Lord of the Rings, which is why I had to get her this neat little cassette box. So this is the Lord of the Rings radio play by BBC. And it's the radio play from 1981. And those cassettes have been released in 1987. And it contains all 13 episodes spread across 13 one hour cassettes. And yeah, apparently there is also a quote unquote limited centenary edition available. I'm saying quote unquote because it is limited to uh, 10,000. So not really that limited. And the prices are still quite low. You can still find them for less than 20 euros. And the only difference is that you get an additional booklet called the Recording of the Rings. And yeah, there is also another version available with a full colored uh, cover artwork. And then there is also a completely different radio play produced by The Mind's Eye, which came out uh, on 12 cassettes in a nice wooden cassette box. But, you know, I don't really know which one of those radio plays is better. And both radio plays are also available on CD. So, yeah, let's take a closer look. There is not really that much going on. We have a little number right here. On the inside we have this nice golden booklet with infos about the author, the book and the BBC radio production. Right here we have the entire cast as well as a little map of the west of Middle-earth. And I do have to say, this map is a lot bigger in the CD version. Yeah, then we of course have all the uh, 13 cassettes. All with the same golden artwork. We have the number and the name of each episode right here on the spine. And infos about each episode and on the inside we only have a ton of copyright claims and when we take a look at the cassette we can see this Dolby logo right here so this is telling us that the cassettes have been recorded with the uh, Dolby B noise reduction so you should also switch that on if you have that on your cassette deck and right here this logo is telling us that those are type 2 chrome tapes yeah so i'm in the middle of uh, recording or digitizing these cassettes right now for my girlfriend and i noticed that on cassette number five the sides are switched so side a is side b and side b is side a but uh, that's really the only difference. So, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching. And I see you in the next totally random video. Bye.